John and I have had some conversations over the, the last couple of years. Today we're here specifically to pick up the portrait of, of General Thomas Moore, who I believe is, is John Tucker's fifth great-grandfather, was an early settler in, in what's now Spartanburg County, both a South Carolina House member, I believe, and also a, a representative from South Carolina in, in that Congress in Washington, D.C. Um, Revolutionary War veteran, also a general in the War of 1812. Our library actually, in its current form, dates back to, to 1940. We're one of the premier research repositories in the South, but really in the United States. And I take pride in the idea that people feel comfortable giving that stuff to us, knowing that it'll be um, both cared for and preserved for posterity, but that also it'll be accessible for researchers. In giving the state of South Carolina, that historic painting, you decided you still wanted a piece of it. I had to have a replica. I had to have something to replace it. And I had noticed Michael King, who is a local artist, and we reconnected after about 50 years. Because you both had gone to Hannah. Both were at Hannah. And I really liked his, his style, I liked his stuff, and I knew what a, a great guy that he was. The main thing is to make sure that it is as close to the original as possible. I talked with John Tucker about this beforehand. We didn't want it to, the new painting to look really antique like the old one did. We wanted it to look a little bit more fresh. So I began to research the general uh, more than what, trying to find more information about the artist for John than what we originally told. And came here and worked from a photograph that I had of. Made a few changes, not a lot, but a few. They were anatomical things. Things that I knew this is the way ears should look. Uh, made those changes and then went from there. And when you got done, were you satisfied with your work? Uh, my wife tells me I'm never satisfied. But I tell her that's actually a good thing. Uh, because when you become satisfied, you quit growing. Someone, I don't know who the artist was, said that a painting is never finished. You just simply stop. And I got to the po point, like I do with all of my paintings, at some point, it's like that inner voice that says, okay, that's it, stop here. This is the first time it has been outside of the family. It was painted a, uh, over 200 years ago. He was a member of Congress from Spartanburg County for uh, four or five terms until the War of 1812, in which he became a major general. And so then he went back to Congress and stayed for two terms and then retired as a planner in Spartanburg. So I'll always have the general, but uh, I think that giving it to the library was the right thing to do and I'm doing it in honor of my mother, and it will be taken care of, and I can share it with South Carolina and anybody else, and still have my general, but I just thought that it was too valuable to be in this house. <laughs>